Jamie and Mitch were doing the Hall Eva and Sunset. They're big contests, so they're pretty cool to be able to get into. I want to be successful and I want to be respected as like an amazing surfer and focus on making heats and getting on tour. Pretty pumping out there, it looks a bit rippy and stuff, but there's definitely some solid sets coming through. I'm pumped. Yeah, I'm stoked. I've been, been surfing a bunch too. Mindset going into Haleiwa, I, I really just want to make as many heats as I can. I'd love to go all the way and win, win the event. I'm a professional surfer, I don't want to let it go away, so I'm going to give it everything I got now and put in 110%. I feel as though Haleiwa suits my surfing. I like big right faces to kind of draw my surfing out. I thought I would have done better. It's just fortunately it was a bit disappointing and I was pretty disappointed in myself. And uh, Well, I lost first heat in the contest in Hollywood, so that's not good. Just watching your friends too, you, you want them to do good. You know that they're going to have a bummed mood when they come out of the water if they don't make it. And especially seeing Mitch be dedicated and Dumpy be dedicated, not going out, not partying. I think they deserve to make it and when they don't, I, I'm of course bummed. Just kind of got to forget about it and go surf. I shake off the loss and basically all I want to do is go and just surf my anger away. Just spend as much time in the water as I can. Do a bit of a backhand air and just kind of roll my ankle pretty nastily. I've never really rolled my ankle like this before. I'm pretty upset. It's just, it's really small. Pretty disappointed in myself because the you know, sun sets around the corner. Broke my heart for him because he really does want to do well in these contests, especially not finishing the way he wanted to in the Haleiwa contest. His day's kind of been really shitty. He's such a shitty day. It's really sad because he's so focused. He doesn't go out. He hasn't, I haven't seen him party once. He just sticks to himself, wants to wake up early, wants to go surfing. He's one of those guys that deserves to make it, so that's why it's sad for me to see him just not able to do it. Today I am uh, off to see the doctor and see what verdict he's got with the ankle, and uh, I'm praying to God that it's not that bad and maybe he can tape it up. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah. So you're um, surfing in the event on next, this next week? Yeah. Worst case scenario, I think if it is serious and I'm gonna have some time out of the water, I might need to go home and just kind of rest. I would understand if he had to go home. Because if, he, I mean, if he's not serving for a month, the last place you wanna be is hanging around here, watching go waves and not being able to surf him. Looks like it's probably grade two, yeah. maybe three ankle sprain. The thing with these are it can take quite a while for them to yeah. you know, get better. Next week is going to be pushing it, you know, yeah, to, to sure. do this. Is it pretty critical for you, the sunset of it? Yeah, that's yeah. what yeah. I'm in. So, but to get you out there yeah. on a big sunset is going to be, uh, you know, a challenge, I can tell yeah. you. So I made the decision to kind of just see how it feels and try, kind of look after it, ice it, wrap it up. And if it feels any better, then obviously I'll give sunset a crack. You know, every once in a while it's fun to have friends over and hang out. Then the night starts progressing. <laughs> and I was just like, oh my god, this is not happening right now. Hey, this is Mitch Cruz. Thanks for watching Surf House. Be sure to tune in to Network A and uh, let us know what you thought about this episode in the comments box below.